Yo, what's going on, everybody? It is Strida the Boston, or aka the King of Boston, and today, whoa, do we are we doing another my player? Uh, what? Oh no. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. If you read the title, yeah, it, it says um, it says live stream my career. So anyway, uh, what this is gonna be is I figured I'd, I'd do the creation in this video, but it's just gonna be like a series that I can live stream. Um, you know, sometimes I, I struggle with things that I want to live stream because I don't like live streaming the stuff that I record. Because, I don't know, it kind of defeats the purpose of putting out the video later on. I know some people think, you know, they don't think that way. That's just how I think. Especially now that I can live stream on YouTube and those videos are going to be going up. So it's like, you know, I, I don't know. But I, I think that I wanted to, I've wanted to have a live stream series like this for a while. And I've decided this would be a good opportunity to. Uh, I've been kind of having a hankering for doing another My Player, My Career type of series. Um, you know, not one for recording or anything like that, just one for kind of playing on my own or live streaming in, in this case. So, I decided to do the Ricky Showcase, do the creation of all this stuff. And uh, if you guys are wondering, this is Cliff Ball, not Chris Ball. Cliff Ball, after being recently discovered by his brother, uh, he has uh, taken him under his wing, gone to some training camps, and has decided to enter the 2012 NBA draft. So, he's going to uh, obviously be doing the Ricky Showcase here, and I'll go through the draft and see, you can see, you guys can see uh, who I get drafted by. And, um,. You know, I'm not going to be live streaming every single game of this guy. You know, obviously play him on my own a little bit, but he's gonna, you know, he's gonna be a guy that I live stream very often. Uh, so you know, you'll see full games and stuff. But anyway, I just thought this would be a neat idea. Um, I didn't see any other Cliff Paul in my careers on YouTube. I didn't search too hard, but uh, search enough. Search like Chris Paul. I mean, Cliff Paul in my career. Cliff Paul in my player. Cliff Paul NBA 2K, NBA 2K13, all that good stuff. So anyway. Um, yeah, so this, hopefully this should be pretty fun. You guys are just kind of kind of see the rookie showcase. Uh, I didn't show too much of it. It's like, what? I'm looking at my timeline. I see six highlights from it. So I made him a pass first point guard, six foot, 175 pounds, born on May 6, 1985. So he's 27 years old. Uh, same exact, like, you know, stats and height and weight and all that stuff as uh, Chris Paul. Gave him number three. Gave him the mustache, of course. The face doesn't look too good, but I thought it was as good as I get it. So anyway, uh, I made him a pass first point guard because it kind of went with the whole idea of the commercial born to assist. And you can see I dish it off to Dion Waiters for the easy assist right there. So if you look at my stat line, he got two points, six rebounds, and seven assists. That kind of shows you how I'm playing with this guy. Oh, I didn't go out here and try to, you know, go number one overall. I tried to kind of fit the idea of being born to assist as, as Cliff Paul was. And you can see I actually ended up getting that inbound steal, but uh, nothing would come out of it. So six points, and seven rebounds, and nine assists. I'm driving into the lane, getting around Damian Lillard, and I'm going to put the layup up and in. I struggled scoring this game. That's definitely something I'm going to have to work on a lot. Um, you know, with this guy, of course, and I'll probably uh, play a lot of blacktop with, with this guy if I, if I run sub sessions or whatever, but anyway, um, I, I, quite honestly, a lot of people always ask me to play blacktop in my live streams, but I just don't play blacktop very often. I'm, not that I'm not that good at it, it's just not that fun to me. I mean, I know it's an easy way to earn VC, but I don't know, it's just not that fun to me, quite frankly. If there was a ladder system, or like a tournament or something, I'm sure it'd be much more fun. But then we're down by four. Dion Wade is going to get the aim up pass. He's going to chuck it up. It's not going to go either way. It wouldn't have mattered. We ended up losing 196. I didn't have that much of an impact. Um, so, you know, I think I, I ended up with like 8 points, 10 rebounds, 13 assists or something like that. I, I was shocked that I was able to get 10 rebounds as a 6 foot, you know, not athletic point guard. But anyway, uh, so we're going to get into the pre-draft interviews and such here. I'm not going to show you the actual interviews. I'm just going to show you the teams that I did get drafted by. Just to kind of speed things up, I'm, you know, I don't want to make you guys sit through a long video right here. This is just kind of an introduction video to my li new live stream series. And yeah, you're going to see the teams I get uh, pre or interviewed by are the Golden State Warriors, the Portland Trail Blazers, and last but not least, the New Orleans Hornets. So I believe that's picks like 8, 10, and 11 or something like that. I'm not really too sure. So anyway, uh, you can see I basically told all of them to go away, go home, and I'm going to end up getting drafted number 12 overall to the Houston Rockets. Uh, the reason so was because I didn't want to play for the Warriors because Tragic Bronson is already in the Warriors. Um, I didn't want to play for the Blazers just because uh, they have Damian Lillard and a lot of people already have, you know, my careers or whatever on the Blazers. And I didn't want to play for the Hornets because I'm just, you know, Tragic Bronson play there and I, I don't know, I just wasn't really feeling it. But the Rockets are a team that I may or may not stick with. We'll have to see. By the way, you can also see here I'm entering my Twitter handle. It's going to be the real CP3 because I'm better than Chris Paul. It's all about Cliff Paul. Anyway, that's pretty much all I have to say, so I'm going to wrap this video up right now. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you did enjoy. I'll, maybe I'll live stream the series this weekend. We'll see. Like I said, it's going to be kind of on and off. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Hope you did enjoy. And so I'm out. Peace.